So what's up guys, Truism C here, and in today's video we're going to be looking at some of the title update 52 great seeds on the console edition of Minecraft. This means that if you guys want to use these seeds, just make sure that you have classic crafting selected and you are on the Xbox or PlayStation. And this can be used on either, you know, the PlayStation 4, PlayStation 3, Xbox One and the Xbox 60. So without further ado guys, enjoy the video and check the description for everything relating to the seeds in the video. So guys, I'm Truism C and enjoy the video. Now we're going to be looking at this awesome seed found by Five Plays, and this seed actually is very, very unique, guys. I've actually never come across a seed like this. So this is where we spawn, and we're going to just move over to here once we see this sand area. Now this sand area is just really, really weird spawning. So we've got this weird structure over here, and um, you know it's just, just really weird because look at this, guys. We have an above ground mob spawner right next to a sand temple with this like really weird underhang and like overpass it's just a very very weird seed but it's also also really really cool so you know you're gonna get some stuff right off the bat from the chest so you're gonna get some beet root seeds. So you guys can start a farm straight away and um i believe in fact that you know you can also get some items from this sand temple as well and there's also another village in the world let me just stop that wall because that's just you know annoying so um we're gonna go down here and i'll just show you guys the seed should be on the screen for this seed and it should be in the description so this is the five play seed i'll link leave a link back to him because he found the seed first so i didn't actually find the seed so you guys can go ahead and subscribe to him so yeah there's a bunch of cool items and this chest is like nearly completely filled which is actually not seen it before so yeah definitely a unique seed i would recommend checking out and um yeah shout out to um five players with this seed because that seed is actually absolutely crazy so um yeah i just wanted to showcase this seed and yeah on to the next seed so also guys i did forget to mention that there is actually a village here and it is at if you look at x154 y71 z-162 and if you just look over here on the map where i am if you guys can't put in the numbers correctly this is where it is so i'm going to be moving on to the next seed now so this is seed number two and this is a seed found by Dave and I don't know if you guys know that content creator but this seed is definitely really awesome. So as you guys can see already we're just straight ahead going and looking at this seed over here. It's really just absolutely insane. So as you guys can see there's a huge village and it's just straight combined right into this um sand temple nearly forgot the name there but yeah as you guys can see so this right off the bat is just the greatest spawn possible i mean i've honestly never seen a, a seed like this and to have this right off the bat in spawn is absolutely insane so um i will leave a link to the seed and the original finders channel so as you guys can see a bunch of items in here i, I don't think you can get diamonds in this in fact can you uh, maybe you can maybe you could but um you kind of get emeralds which is really useful for trading with villagers and then as you guys can see over here do we have a blacksmith unfortunately we don't have a blacksmith but nonetheless like i always say when we're going to be looking at villages guys we are can we are we can always get some you know resources through you know just mining the crops and then using that to you know get a ton of crops and then we can even use those crops to trade with villagers like wheat for example we can use that to trade with villagers so i'm going to show you guys some other cool stuff things about this also what's cool about this seed guys is that the end portal is directly at spawn so as you guys can see here at y66 y30 z327 the end portal is right here at spawn and i'm not sure why there's a bunch of water you know just just i honestly have no idea maybe that's just how water spawned in a really weird seed but yeah this is um this is the this is where it is and um it's really cool so i guess it's like uh, just just uh, honestly guys just one of the best seeds i've ever seen so now we're going to be looking at the last seed and this seed is actually really really cool so firstly right off the bat for some reason i spawned over here and we've got a sand temple that's straight in our face so if we look right here into the chest as you guys can see we've got a bunch of items that are going to help us survive in the wild so once again we have uh, you know enchanting book which is lore 2 i'm actually not sure what that does but nonetheless guys it's still a great seed so right off the bat you've got some materials then very very close to you i will put all the lengths and all the um all the coordinates not lengths in the description so you guys can find everything and as you guys can see over here we've got another village and we also have as you guys can see a bunch of items and this chest for some reason these chests seem to be more full than the other ones i don't know because in some chests i sometimes only see like three or four items and in some of them i'm seeing like eight or so items and if you guys just look at this right here like this is actually just really weird so as you guys can see there's a whole block of um dirt simply just you know for this little village um 
crafting garden area here which is really really weird so like this villager could just you know drop off at any time but for some reason he hasn't actually been able to do that yet so i just thought that is actually just a really little cool thing to showcase about the seed as well and um, we're going to look in the enchantment table chest here so as i was saying this is actually a blacksmith and what we have in here is once again a bunch of items and it seems that you know we've got more items in here than the normal blacksmith chest so nonetheless guys this seed has a lot more things to explore but i'll leave you guys to up to explore it and look at it because i want you guys to have a great survival adventure and a great survival time the coordinates of everything will be in the description and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well guys and subscribe to other people's channel and also guys check out the bonus seed because there is a bonus seed that i found that i think is really cool and you guys should check it out and it's gonna go a huge range of awesome cool features that i just don't want to put in the video i want to see who checks out the bonus seed and let me know what you guys find so guys been juicing see don't forget to check the description regarding everything and until next so as i was saying this is actually a blacksmith and what we have in here is once again a bunch of items and it seems that you know we've got more items in here than the normal blacksmith chest so nonetheless guys this seed has a lot more things to explore but i'll leave you guys to up to explore it and look at it because i want you guys to have a great survival adventure and a great survival time the coordinates of everything will be in the description and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well guys and subscribe to other people's channel and also guys check out the bonus seed because there is a bonus seed that i found that i think is really cool and you guys should check it out and it's gonna go a huge range of awesome cool features that i just don't want to put in the video i want to see who checks out the bonus seed and let me know what you guys find so guys been choosing see don't forget to check the description regarding everything and until next time peace from me